Hello dear doctors, I am Dr. Janna Tulfariya Preeti, one of the mentors of Doctors Academy in PLAB1 preparation course. PLAB exam is Professional and Linguistic Assessment Board exam. It is a licensing exam. Nowadays, it has been replaced by UK MLA exam introduced by GMC in 2024. Now, what is the concern of what is UK MLA exam? UK MLA exam is United Kingdom Medical Licensing Assessing exam. There is nothing to worry about it because PLAB exam and UK MLA exam is same as before. There is nothing changed in it, only the name has been changed. The PLAB exam has two parts, part 1 and part 2. Part 1, it is a written clinical exam and part 2, it is a face-to-face -face practical exam. There are 180 questions for the PLAB 1 examination. It is a single-based, multiple-choice examination. For each question, there will be 5 options. You have to choose one single best answer for the each question. And each question contains one mark. So, the total mark will be 180 and the total time will be 3 hours without any break. You need to get 65 to 70 percent to pass in the exam. Every session of the year, there is a cut mark to pass in the examination. And this cut mark is between 110 to 118. So if you can get above these marks, then you will certainly pass this examination. This examination, the question pattern has three domains in which GMC will judge you to assess and pass this examination. The domains are 1. Assessment, number 2. Management and number 3. That is the most important, applying knowledge and experience. GMC wants to see that how good and empathic doctor you are and they want to see you how safe you are for the patients. So the question criteria of the all 180 marks will be dependent on this criteria. Medical qualification. You must have a valid MBBS degree for the PLAB1 examination. Even if you have passed your MBBS examination but has not completed your internship, still you can sit for the PLAB1 examination. The second thing is a valid OED or ILTS certificate. For the ILTS purpose, you need 7.5 band or more to sit for the PLAB1 examination. And in case of OET, you need 350 or more out of 500 marks to sit for the PLAB1 examination. And this is called B band. Whether you call it B band or pass mark, you need this for the examination. Now, ILTS versus OET. What to choose for your examination? OET is Occupational English Test Exam. It is easier for the doctors to pass in the OET relative to ILTS exam because all the four modules of the OET like listening, speaking, reading and writing all the questions will be in medical related topics. For the doctors, it is much more easier to get the desirable marks in the exam. The validity of OET certificate is 3 years. So, you must appear in the PLAB 1 examination within these 3 years. But for the PLAB 2 examination, you do not need any validity or valid certificate of the OET. Now, when and where to give PLAB 1 examination? The exam is held 4 times a year. That is February, May, August and November. You can take any of these sets for your upcoming examination. Where you can give this examination? If you are a Bangladeshi student, then you can give it in Bangladesh as well as United Kingdom. But if you do not get the seats in our country or United Kingdom, you can also give this exam in the other overseas country like India, Sri Lanka, Scotland, Ireland, New Zealand, Australia, South Africa and Saudi Arabia. All the international candidates can sit anywhere in the world to take this exam according to your requirements. Fees of the exam The fee for the PLAB1 examination is £268 and fees for the PLAB2 examination is £981. Career opportunity of PLAB examination 
If you pass PLAB examination and after that you will receive GMC registration that will allow you to practice in the UK as a doctor. And after that, if you have worked in the NHS for the few years, then you can also get a job in the other countries like Australia, New Zealand, Scotland, Ireland and other Middle East countries with a very good salary and a very good opportunities. About the preparation syllabus and preparation time. Plan examination is a vast examination because the syllabus is all of your MBBS syllabus and as it is an expensive examination so I would suggest you to take preparation for at least four months. In our doctor academy we have courses available on four months, three months and two months. We have both online and offline classes. We here at the Doctor Academy have compiled all the study materials together so that you can get all of these things together and get your best preparation time. In our Doctor Academy, we made our lecture notes based on and combining all the study materials like Lab 1 Keys, Lab Gems and med revision. After joining Doctor Academy, you will have an access to our e-learning platform. Even if you have missed any of your live classes, you can do it in your convenient time on our e-learning platform. All the previous classes, updated classes, lecture notes, playable question bank and all the mock exams will be available on our e-learning platform. We have a great mentor team who will support you until you pass the exam. If you need any help from our mentor team as well as administrative team, you will get continuous support till your exam. We will be always there for you to help you at any time. So dear doctors, I would like to welcome all of you to the Doctors Academy to pursue your preparation in Lab 1 course and complete your examination within a very short period of time. Thank you.